Hello boys and girls, are you ready for your read aloud 2 lesson today? Well today we are going to do something that has to do with counting. That's called hippity hoppity. So if you remember when we were in the classroom, um, we, we did this and I wanted you to do something that's called subitizing, where you just look at something and you guess or decide how many there are, okay? So I'm going to use my hands for hippity hoppity. And I'm gonna say hippity hoppity, how many? And I'm gonna hold up some fingers and I want you to guess how many fingers I'm holding up. All right, are you ready? Hippity hoppity, how many? 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 Whoop. Hippity hoppity, how many? Whoop. Hippity hoppity, how many? Ah, I tricked you that time. All right, let's try this one more time. And this time, I'm gonna let you tell me how many I'm holding up, but then I'm not gonna tell you if you have the correct answer. So here we go. Hippity hoppity, how many? Did you say one? You're correct. All right, hippity hoppity, how many? Did you say three? You're correct. Hippity hoppity, how many? Did you say five? You're correct. Hippity hoppity, how many? Did you say two? You are correct. Hippity hoppity, how many? Did you say six? You're correct. All right, so that's hippity hoppity. So parents, you can do this with your children as well at home. Very easy just to say hippity hoppity and slash the number of, of fingers. Um, if they seem to be having a little difficulty with this, then you can hold up your fingers, you know, one, two, however many you hold up, and then let them count, you know, for um, a little while while they're doing it, and then try it again without letting them count. Just and this is something that um, will take a lot of practice, um, but something that they will e eventually figure out. So that's called subitizing, and the game is hippity hoppity. Thank you so much for participating. Goodbye.